dirty shit to pick up at the drop clean. I got a tidy bitch to pick up, I got love Selena. Shady hop up in the whip, but I ain't never seen it. Shady love the way I whip it in a two seater. Hey all, thank you so much for joining me for another Lethal's Vape Reviews. Today we're going to be taking a look at a pod kit that I picked up for the purpose of this review. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Vupu Drag Nano Pod Kit. Right there. Right there. It's a very neat little device. Uh, I'm not going to go into too much detail just yet. We're going to take it down below. Take a look at all of the... Uh, yeah, take a look at all the features. Take a look at everything that comes in the box. Uh, give you guys an overview of the device itself and what comes with it. And then we'll bring it back up top, have a few uh, vapes off of it, give you guys my final thoughts. So without further ado, guys, let's take this down below. Here we are, guys. We have the Drag Nano Pod Kit here. This is the fan's version. It does come with a chain necklace. This is Klein Blue. Up top, we see the Vupu. Down here, we see Drag Nano Pod Kit. On this side, what we have is all of the social media links. Top, there's nothing. Bottom, there's nothing. Other side is a uh, QR code for technical support. Uh, and that's that. On the back, what we have are the contents and warnings. We also have a scratch and sniff here. All of the do not throw in a bins designed by Vupu in California. Uh, and that's that. You get a Drag Nano USB cable warranty card pods, uh, a pod, my apologies, user manual, chain necklace, and a gene chip card. So let's go ahead, open it up, and take a look at what's inside. So underneath what you'll have is the designed by Vupu uh, instruction manual. It's also got a warranty card in there. This is the, as you can tell, the Drag Nano Pod Cat. This is the user manual, got in all sorts of different languages, English, Dutch, uh, Russian. It's got in a bunch of different ones. Uh, but yeah, so that's the manual. Put that off to the side. Inside there, you also get your warranty card. Here we go. Purchase information. Fill that out just in case. Uh, inside also, you get the gene chip card. There you go says powerful chip born for fever mm, not quite sure if that's what they meant i think they meant flavor but born for fever i guess that works too so let's go ahead and put that stuff back into the envelope and put that off to the side inside the package what you will get is a micro usb charging cable you get your obviously the chain the silver chain that comes with the nano kit you get a single pod right here one milliliter in capacity and of course you get the device itself the vupu drag nano here we go as you can see it's very very tiny looks same form factor as its bigger predecessor um, nice resin panel just like on the originals nice drag uh, text on the back, engraving on the back, like the usual. Uh, you've got the pod insertion point. You've got a little snap ring here to put the chain on. Uh, it is 54.5 millimeters in height, 35 millimeters in width, and it is 11 millimeters thick. It weighs 55 grams. Pod capacities, as I said, are one milliliter. The battery inside of here is a 750 Ma integrated battery. On the side, what we have is a LED light, battery light indicator. All right, you've got your charge port down the bottom. It says Gene Chip on it. Is Gene Chips are installed in these. Nothing on that side, but uh, it's very nice. Nice put together, solid, doesn't rattle or anything. Nice, very nice. Uh, what else can we say about this? Guys, it's got a laundry list of features. It's got that 750 mAh rechargeable battery, one milliliter replaceable pods with integrated coils. It's got magnetic pod connection, direct voltage-based output, draw-activated firing. It is made of zinc aluminum alloy. It's, there are uh, gene chip features in this. Let's go over those. Intelligent cold boost pattern, precise output power control system, switch timeout, 
short circuit protection, overcharge protection, over discharge protection, output overcurrent protection, and it also has that micro USB port for charging. Guys, like I said, laundry list of features. Let's go ahead after having taken a quick look at uh, everything there is about this pod kit. Uh, let's take it back up top and we'll have a few more rips off of it and uh, let you guys know what I think. There you got it, guys. We have the Vupu Drag Nano pod kit system. So what do I think about this? As you guys know, most of you know, I'm not a huge fan of pod systems. I have been using them more often lately uh, just to get a feel for the, the systems, the devices. Um, and I got to tell you, of all the ones that I've tried, I'm really enjoying this one probably more than the others. Um, probably the most, to be honest with you guys. 750 milliamp hour battery, rechargeable, can't replace it. Uh, once it's dead, it's dead. You got to throw it away, but they're relatively cheap enough. Uh, in sh in BNM's shop, bleh, bleh, bleh. Um, in BNM shops, this would run you about forty dollars, which is not horrible price for a pod kit. At least not inside of a BNM shop. If you're going to go shop online, you can get them for about twenty bucks. Um, so what do I think about it? I love how classy it looks. I really do. I think that is a very classy looking pod kit. Um, I don't think it's very uh, appealing to children at all. Uh, I like the fact that it comes with a, a chain instead of one of those nylon lanyards. Um, I think it's a little bit more durable and it looks kind of kind of neat hanging around your neck. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. Let me see if you guys can see the light. Probably not. There you go. It activates when you're dragging on it. It'll activate, um, it'll light up blue when it's about midpoint in the battery life. And then when it goes red, it's about dead. It's time to charge it up. Um, again, one millimeter pod, uh, milliliter pod capacity. Uh, they are replaceable. Here we go. Completely replaceable. Cannot change out the coil. Once you, uh, once that coil starts to go bad, you got to change the pod. Um, I've already filled this about six times uh, since I started using it. I haven't had an issue yet with the pods. No leaking, um, no oversaturation, nothing popping into my mouth, no juice anywhere. Um, it's been very, very clean. It's been uh, very easy to use, very easy to, to carry around with you. Uh, if you're going outside, if you're going uh, to a store or something, you don't want to bring one of your big mods with you. You don't want to bring a mech with you. Uh, you don't want to be a dripping uh, when you're out. So, um, yeah, I think this is a, a good option for those who want to just take something small and put it in their shirt pocket or hang it around their neck like I do. Uh, I do this all the time. I just let it hang, and I bring it with me pretty much everywhere, uh, at least I have for the past week while trying it out. And even though I'm not a fan, a huge fan of pod kits, I think this one is going to be sticking around for quite some time. Uh, guys, that's what I've got for you today. This was a look at the Drag Nano pod kit. If you liked this video, please do hit the like button. If you're not already subscribed to me, hit the sub button. Also hit that notification bell so you guys know when I go live or update, uh, upload new content. Um, big love to you all. If you guys want to show some love and support the channel, we do have a Patreon. Uh, we also have a merch store on Teespring. Anyways, guys, I love you guys. Thank you so much. I look forward to seeing you in the next one. But until then, peace.